Hey guys, and welcome to PrimaPrep.com. Today we're going to be talking about the Mercure 180, otherwise known as the Mercure Long Handle. And it got its name because it has a really long handle, obviously. Uh, it does look like the Mercure 33C, or the Mercure Classic, and I'm pretty sure it has the exact same headpiece. And the handle is just a little bit longer, so it has more of this gritty metal covering the handle because it's longer as the 33C does. And obviously it's a little bit heavier because it has a longer handle. But let's talk, let's jump right into it and then talk about it. Uh, so it weighs 2.15 ounces, which for a safety razor that has a handle that long, that's pretty light uh, it's on the light side. And if you take off the handle, you could feel that for how big it is, how long it is, it really doesn't weigh too much. So there's not too much heft to it because it's a pretty thin handle. Um... So, let's talk about the balance. Um, it is, it does have a good balance, I'd say. When I'm shaving with it, uh, I like to be holding the safety razor right at the top of the grip, and that's where the balance point is. Uh, so it does feel good, and it does have a long handle, so if you have smaller hands, you might have trouble maneuvering it from like a downward shaving hand position to an upward shaving hand position. I have fairly large hands, so I have no trouble getting getting it past that thumb and index finger point as I'm switching it around with one hand. But people with small hands do have trouble. Um, I've talked to friends and read online that people think the handle's too long for them, and that's just personal preference, how big your hands are, and how it feels in your hand. Um, for me, I like it. Um, and I have large enough hands to handle it. Let's talk about the grip. It does have the same gritty metal as the 33C, uh, 34C, um, and actually it kind of looks like the 34C. If you if you watch my review on the 33C, they both looked like the 34C. When it came, I thought this bottom piece was a knob that you could turn, uh, but it's not. But it does, since it does protrude and have this gritty metal at the bottom, I really like that. Uh, Either have your pinky on it, or your pinky on the bottom. Either way, you know where the end is, and it's, it'd be hard to slip out. Even if you got, if you slipped out of this gritty metal right here, you'd probably catch yourself here. Um, you know, the grip is top of the line. This gritty metal is really can't be beaten by any other uh, type of grip, in my opinion. Uh, in terms of aggressiveness, I rated the 33C. Um, about a, f a six, and I'd say this is a little bit less aggressive just because it has extra weight. Uh, you don't need to put too much pressure on it. You can just let the weight fall. Even though it's not a very heavy safety razor, it's um, less aggressive than the 33C, in my opinion. Uh, blade replacement is just a typical three-piece design. Very sturdy, just like every Mercury I've ever purchased. And let's just throw in a blade real fast. I'll show you the blade gap. Obviously, if you've ever owned a three-piece, you know it's not that difficult. Just keep your fingers on the side and be careful. You should be just fine. So cool, yeah, if you could see the blade gap right there. Um, you know. A good amount of the blade is exposed, and that's why I, it does feel aggressive to me. Also, because it doesn't weigh that much. But just as I was talking about with the 33C, if you just takes a little bit of practice with a little bit more aggressive safety razors to get used to it. And if you want something a little bit less aggressive, maybe go with the 34C or like an Edwin Jagger DE89 LBL. Those are both good options. Parkers in general are a little bit more aggressive, but overall if you had to rate the whole Mercure family as um, on how aggressive they are, I'd say they're pretty mild. You know, four or five is about the average for most of the Mercures. A lot of the head geometries are very similar, if not the same. It's kind of hard to tell, and then it all depends on how much it weighs um, and where the balance point is to determine the rest. Um, but yeah, it's a good, it's a good safety razor, you know, just like the 33 classic, um, 
If you just want something, if you like the Classic, but you think the handle's a little too short, this would be a good option for you. I'd go with the 180 long handle. I'm not sure why they called it a 180. They were sticking in the 30s with like 34C, 33C, 39C, 37C, and then they just jumped to 180. Uh, I don't know why they did that. But, um, yeah, it's very basic, simple, clean, sturdy design. Uh, you can't really go wrong with it. Um, you know, it's kind of aggressive, but with just a little practice and t technique, you should be just fine. Uh, I like using it. I use it with derbies often uh, because with feathers, I could get. I got to be really careful. Um, ho hopefully, you guys liked my Mercure 180 long handled review, guys. Uh, leave a comment down below if you have any questions, or head over to primandprep.com. The written article should have a little bit more details on it. Uh, I'm sure I was forgetting something as I was doing the video review. I thought I covered my bases, though. Uh, head over there for more male grooming tips, uh, reviews, and other cool stuff. Thanks, guys. Bye.